Have you ever paused to wonder where the future of technology lies? What will power the devices of tomorrow? Now consider the humble semiconductor, the unsung hero of our digital age. It's the powerhouse behind every device we use, from our smartphones to our laptops, even our smart refrigerators. The semiconductor is the heart of the digital revolution, pulsating with every bit and byte of data processed. However, as we push boundaries, we're demanding more from these tiny components. We want them faster, smaller, and more energy efficient. But there's a limit to how much our current silicon-based semiconductors can deliver. As our thirst for technology grows, so does the need for a superior semiconductor. And that's where our story takes an exciting turn. Enter graphene, a material that holds the promise to revolutionize the semiconductor industry. So, let's delve into this fascinating world of graphene semiconductors and explore how they could shape the future of technology. So, what exactly is graphene? An excellent question. Graphene is a single thin layer of carbon atoms arranged in a two-dimensional honeycomb lattice. It's essentially a super thin slice of graphite, the stuff found in your everyday pencil, but don't let that fool you. This material is anything but ordinary. Graphene is renowned for its unique properties. It's incredibly light, yet its strength surpasses that of steel. It's an excellent conductor of heat, and most importantly for our discussion, of electricity. These characteristics alone make graphene a promising candidate for a multitude of applications, from flexible electronics to high-speed computing. However, harnessing graphene's potential hasn't been a walk in the park. For years, scientists and engineers grappled with a significant challenge. Despite its excellent conductivity, graphene lacks a band gap, an essential property for semiconductor operation. Without a band gap, graphene couldn't be switched off, making it unsuitable for use in digital technology. Over the years, numerous techniques were tried to induce a band gap in graphene, from applying strain to doping the material with other elements. Still, these methods often compromised graphene's desirable properties, or were not suitable for large-scale production. This left the dream of a graphene-based semiconductor seeming more like a pipe dream. While graphene held immense potential, creating a functional graphene semiconductor seemed out of reach until now. A recent breakthrough has made the impossible possible. For years, the dream of a functional graphene semiconductor has been just that, a dream. But now that dream is rapidly turning into a reality. In the heart of a bustling laboratory, a team of dedicated scientists and engineers have done what was once deemed unattainable. They've developed the world's first ever functional graphene semiconductor. This breakthrough is nothing short of a technological marvel, a testament to human ingenuity and perseverance. This wasn't a simple task. The team had to overcome numerous obstacles and challenges. They had to redefine and redesign traditional semiconductor fabrication techniques, developing new methods to suit the unique properties of graphene. It was a monumental task that required a blend of innovation, creativity, and sheer determination. One of the key techniques used was an advanced lithography process, which allowed for the precise patterning of graphene on a microscopic scale. This was coupled with a revolutionary doping process to control the electronic properties of graphene, setting the stage for its use as a semiconductor. But the journey didn't end there. The team also had to devise a way to integrate graphene with existing semiconductor technology, a feat that required a deep understanding of both graphene's properties and the intricacies of semiconductor design. This breakthrough holds the promise to change the face of technology as we know it. As we stand on the brink of this new era, we can only imagine the advancements that lie ahead, fueled by the power of graphene semiconductors. How does a graphene semiconductor compare to a traditional silicon one? This question is a gateway to understanding the game-changing potential of graphene semiconductors. Let's start with the basics. Silicon has been the star of the semiconductor world for decades, powering everything from computers to smartphones. However, as our demand for faster and more efficient technology grows, silicon is beginning to show its limitations. Enter graphene. This single layer of carbon atoms arranged in a two-dimensional honeycomb lattice has properties that could blow silicon out of the water. First up, it's about a hundred times more conductive than silicon, meaning that electrons can move significantly faster through graphene. This could translate to faster processing speeds and more efficient power usage, a dream come true for tech enthusiasts everywhere. Next up, durability. Graphene is incredibly strong, about 200 times stronger than steel in fact. This could lead to more robust and longer lasting devices, potentially revolutionizing not just how we use technology, but how we build it. Lastly, graphene is flexible and transparent, 
a combination not found in silicon. These properties open the door to a whole new world of possibilities, such as bendable electronics and transparent circuits. The advantages are clear, but what does this mean for the future of technology? Well, we'll tackle that in the next segment. Stay tuned. Imagine a world with electronics powered by graphene semiconductors. This isn't just a wild guess or a sci-fi dream, but a very real possibility that could revolutionize our digital era. With the recent breakthrough of functional graphene semiconductors, we're looking at a future where electronic devices could be faster, more efficient, and more durable than ever before. In the realm of computing, graphene semiconductors could lead to a new generation of supercomputers, capable of processing complex data at speeds that make today's fastest machines seem sluggish. Imagine downloading an entire season of your favorite show in the blink of an eye, or running simulations that could help us understand the mysteries of the universe. In the world of electronics, we're talking about devices that are lighter, more flexible, and more energy efficient. Think about your smartphone, your laptop, your smartwatch. Now imagine them with double the battery life, or screens that are virtually unbreakable. But before we get carried away, let's remember that the road to commercialization isn't without challenges. There's the issue of cost, for starters. Graphene is not yet as affordable as silicon. Then there's the matter of scalability. Can we produce graphene semiconductors on a large scale without compromising their extraordinary properties? The journey is just beginning, and it may take a decade or two before we see graphene semiconductors in our everyday devices. But the future of technology, powered by graphene, is an exciting prospect. As we journey into this new frontier of technology, let's recap what we've learned. We've delved into the properties of graphene, a material with incredible strength, flexibility, and conductivity. We've discussed the challenges faced in the past, the breakthroughs that have led to the development of the first-ever functional graphene semiconductor, and the innovative techniques used to achieve this. We've compared graphene to traditional silicon, illustrating how graphene's superior properties could potentially lead to improvements in speed and efficiency in our electronic devices. At the same time, we've discussed the future implications, how this could revolutionize computing and electronics, and the possible challenges in its commercialization. As we stand on the brink of this technological revolution, it's exciting to imagine where these developments might lead us. Thank you for joining us on this journey into the future of technology. Share your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe for more insights into the world of tech.